bobbin winding. It's a good thing. So, take our bobbin. Empty bobbin. Empty bobbin. Put the whole side into the little bobbin holder on the top. Take our single thread. Push it up through one of the top openings and top holes of the bobbin itself. Click the little holder down and we'll step on it. One thing I forgot to mention. It makes a more even wind if you put it through the little holder. It's pretty fantastic. It doesn't take very long. And that's what it does. It pops right off the little holder button, holder for the bobbin, pops right off whenever it's done and full. So that's how you know whenever you're ready to cut the cord. Another thing that is very useful to know, uh, whenever you place the bobbin that is fully loaded back into the little bobbin holder, the flap of the bobbin holder comes out like this. It's on a spring loaded. So you just hold the little flap that kind of locks it into place as you place the bobbin in there. It doesn't fall out. So you pull it through here, back around. Sometimes you gotta kind of coax it. And it gets held in that tooth. And that's how it's fed through. So in order to put the bobbin in, just gotta kind of line the holes up, and there is a little catch right there that it sits in. And you can wiggle it around, make sure that it's in there, and that's whenever you know your bobbin is secure.